so we're at Colorado Ski Chairs. Uh, we probably have about 10,000 skis here that we've gotten and we recycle and upcycle into chairs that are more usable for people to have at their homes. Uh, we take in people's skis to make chairs out of their stuff as well and snowboards and we ship them out from here all over the U.S. We've shipped them all overseas as well so we can make some pretty amazing stuff. We have a couple different styles, uh, a lot of shot skis. Using old ski poles to make plungers out of them which is also always a good laugh and then um, ski benches, snowboard benches. Uh, there's a lot of different things we've done with skis and snowboards. So Adam Vernon started the ski shop about 15, 16 years ago in his garage, mainly making it for friends with his kids, uh, building chairs, some of the kids painting some of the chairs, and then uh, kind of kept growing for him from there. And then it was like he really wanted to pursue it and then moved into this location about eight years ago, and then we've slowly grown every year since. So usually it starts with getting skis, right? So we're going and picking up donations, buying skis from all over, and we get skis and then we debind them. We sort them out down here by color, and then we usually go through and uh, we can make chairs based on color. Some people will come through and pick out the skis for their chairs, and then that's how the, chair, the skis will get reused. Some skis are kind of rough, so those are the ones we know we're going to sand and then give to an artist to be able to be painted. It's very unique. It's a very unique place to work. It's very uh, fun to deal with people that are excited about what they're getting. You know, it's not like a thing people need. It's just something they want. It makes them happy. And it's cool to see them happy when you deliver it to their house and things like that. Or getting their old skis that have been laying around and making them useful again. It's, it's cool to see their face. And some people have a lot of sentiment with them. And then like you feel it too. And it's a big responsibility taking care of their stuff and making it into something useful again.